วัสดีค่ะ I'm สดชินลิมเกรียงกาย and welcome to be my guest the program that brings you successful stories of institutions and entrepreneurs both international and domestic arenas Today we will be finding out more about t u r k i t Bandit University, Faculty of Fine and Applied Arts, how they incorporate the government's 4.0 policy into their curricula, and how they help support their students to become more successful in their career. Let's find out more with our guest today. Today we are joined by Mrs. k a m u n s i r i Wongmuk, Associate Dean for Administration, Faculty of Fine and Applied Arts of t u r a k i t Bandit University. สวัสดีค่ะสวัสดีค่ะ Thank you for joining us today. First of all, let me ask you about the 4.0 policy that the university has been trying to apply to the faculty. Can you explain to us a little bit more about this? As we know that Thailand. Uh, So part zero, yes, is an uh, economy model mm. aimed at to pulling Thailand out from the middle income trap. Yes, uh, to high income range mm. and focuses on value based economy. Mm. So uh, small and medium enterprises shall be smart and mm. low skilled workers uh, shall be. Supported and trained to become highly educated and trained. Uh, so uh, to transform everything into yes. Thailand uh, 4.0, the country has to uh, improve itself. Yeah, and has to to enhance the skills of the people enhance, as well. Enhance the 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 skill. Into, uh, through the competitiveness, mm. through innovation and creativity. I see. Uh-huh. In a part of education, mm. we are in the education part. Yes. Uh, not only our faculty, mm. but uh, in t u l a t i b a d i University, yeah. we provide the students or the freshmen mm. uh, about this kind of topics. I see. Uh, the general education. Mm. Uh, curriculum encompasses mm. uh, integrated topics such as uh, Thailand 4.0, mm. uh, fintech, mm. and creativity and innovation, digital social system. I see. Something like this to 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 provide them to have this kind of ideas. Uh, the subjects are together with the facilities that mm. uh, the university provide. For example, maker space, I see. Uh, drone, digital 3D printing. Mm. And so on. Mm. So, uh, so right now, uh, all the freshmen they have some 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 kind of ideas, and we uh, faculty of fine applied arts, we are strong in teaching the students in uh, creativity and innovation. I see. We uh, there are three programs in in our faculty, which are interior design, uh, mm. fashion design, and fashion business, and uh, computer graphic. Okay. And we believe that uh, the aesthetics and the new creativity concepts are dispensable, mm. uh, indispensable for everything. Not only in the business part, but in also in daily life. So uh, our t- uh, the program equips the students to uh, prepare themselves in a way. Yeah, to to generate creative idea and. Mm. And uh, use their skills mm. to to uh, to find what they're good at, maybe. Yeah, and analyze critical mm. uh, critical thinking and try. We all the teachers try to help them to mm. and push uh, their works uh, via the projects to 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 be uh, practical reality. I see. So basically, you've been teaching your your first year students already some ideas of you know the 4.0 kind of thing, some something that they could prepare themselves for later when they choose their major. So so basically, like there are three majors right now, and which are can you can you tell us one more time what are the three majors in your faculty? Uh, 
uh, there are interior design, mm. computer graphic, mm. and fashion design, and fashion business. I see. And this, the children, I mean the students, when will they get to choose their major? The second year or the third year? No, no they, they choose the, the major since they are uh, in the first year. Ah, I see. So basically they already prepared themselves and then they'll be ready to to choose their major yes. after that as well. Yes. I see. Well, in our next break, we will talk more about each major and then we'll elaborate more about how 4.0 is helping the students as well. We'll now take a short break. Hi everyone, I'm Pim. I'm studying in computer graphic design at DPU. To talk about my study and technology, I believe creativity is made things different and unique. Technology is tool for supporting my work. Turkish Bandit University provides the various kinds for us. For example, computer labs, photo studio, the laser cutting, and printer for everyone to practice. For me, I love character design, so I be able to create my character design to 3D design. It looks so real and it can turn around. I'm so excited. So uh, in the faculty, we like a big family, Inter interior design, fashion design, computer design. We like a brother and sister. We spend many time together and help each other. So that's why I love here. Come and join us. Design your future with a new experience here at Faculty of Fine and Apply Art. Welcome back to the program. We are still here with Mrs. Gamunsiri Wongmuk, Associate Dean for Administration, Faculty of Fine and Applied Arts, Turakit Bandit University. Welcome back to our second break. Earlier we already talked about the 4.0 policy that has been implemented. So can you tell us about the purpose? Why has the university decided to implement this? Uh, because uh, the, the university right now, we cannot uh, be as the in the past anymore. Mm. Uh, we cannot stay apart from the industry. Yes. Collaboration between university and industry uh, will be very useful mm. for the students uh, to bring uh, to for the knowledge transfer, the acquisition, the promotion of entrepreneurs, mm. and and everything. So right now we try to to go out uh, to, to let the student not only stay in the classroom, but uh, we try to have the more uh, partners and stakeholders and mm. uh, from outside education. Mm. And, and we think that it would be great for, for our students. I see. And I've heard that your faculty right now is trying to aim to create students to become design creators. So can you explain to us what is design creators and how are you trying to do that? Creator is someone who invented something, right? Mm. Uh, I think right now every university and every faculty talk about creativity and innovation. Mm. But uh, how can we create, how can we present or mm. communicate what, uh, what, when we have an idea? Mm. Our students have that skill, you know. Uh, maybe some, some other faculties, yes. they, they, they have uh, some idea or creativity, but they cannot, they cannot explain it, or they cannot show the realistic. Mm. But uh, our students, they, they, uh, we assign the projects to the student, uh, 
express themselves. Yes, and they have to do the in in each they have to do in the design process. You know, I see. In every design process, we, they need to start with the preliminary sketch, mm. develop idea and fixed idea sketch, mm. and after that they need to to make a prototype. Uh, all the design process, they they need to learn. Uh, by mistakes, mm. and I think that will be the ability from 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 the mistakes, and which will be uh, the qualification that the industry need uh, mm. from the students. I think. I see. And in all these three majors, is it the same process? Everyone has to go through like the sketching, the prototype stage. Does do all the students have to go through this? Yes. Yes. And. Uh, Although we don't really have the real workshop for, mm. for the student to, to uh, study, but we uh, we have a, a partner in the industry, and they allow us to to uh, to go to visit the factory and use the facilities. Mm. That will be a good opportunity for the students, and because you know uh, we are like the R and D part of them. Mm. Uh, when the industry and the student work together, they get they get a uh, fresh idea from the students, mm. and the student get the facility and some maybe funding or so I some see. many things in that. Uh, so right now we we try to 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 have this kind of projects. I see. So so you have partners outside as well, and yes. you send your students there. So what do they do there? Do they like go sewing, or what do they do there with the partners? Uh, we we have the partner in each uh, curriculum mm. community. Mm. Uh, for example, the major companies in furniture design, mm. uh, the fashion brand, uh, the garment factory, I and see. also the graphic design house. Mm. We have the partner in. in I see. So it's a good way because your partners and the students they get something in return. The, yes. the students get experience, yes. get the opportunity, yes. and the partners get ideas. Yes. So is it is it considered already successful? Has it been like a long time that this hap this partnership happened? Uh, actually, we uh, we we just we we start very hard uh, and we were very hard mm. since the beginning of this year okay uh, we try to make a startup ecosystem for our students I see uh, uh, we start from develop our syllabus to, to have the there are three keywords for in, in our faculty okay creativity technology and business okay and we try to uh, make an infrastructure like a maker space co-working space and incubate could program for the student and now we ex try to expand the neighbor uh, in the area of universities, mm. like exchange program I see. and uh, support organization to, mm. to, for the sponsor and competition and uh, new curriculum and mm. uh, government to create traffic and startup community I and see. also the funding organization. Mm. So to, this year it's been the, the busy year for you, like yes. for the faculty as well. Yes. I yes. see. We. Uh, we try to change from the faculty, from the university faculty, to be a hub, mm. uh -huh. uh, connecting uh, the partners and the stakeholders to to uh, for the knowledge exchange, mm. for the combination of teaching, learning, mm. uh, knowledge transfer, competition, and, and everything to in one. Yes, I yes. see, uh, and uh, and I think it will allow the student to to obtain the, the real experience. Of course, um, definitely. Well, we take a quick break here and when we come back, we'll talk more. Sawadee Hello everyone. My name is Siliwan Bupa. I'm from Interior Design major. For me, a way to be a good design creator is the opportunity to access and have internship in major company. Here, my advisor had provided me a chance to go for it. This chance will make me to develop my art working skills a lot. And then after I graduate, I can apply the knowledge I gain from an internship to my work life in the future.
ASEAN Economic Community. Having the same hopes and mutual intentions to create sustainable growth and permanent economic progress within the framework of the ASEAN Comprehensive Investment Agreement. The ACIA exists to facilitate trade and commerce between member nations, as well as to improve quality of people's lives. One vision, one identity, one community. Hello everyone, my name is Tipa Nandan Gaiwan Prapa. I come from fashion design and fashion business major. Today I will come talk about when I was doing a project with China Asian International College. It's, yes, it's, I have learned so much during this project. It's where, it was been a great time. But the most important thing that I have learned from this project is called teamwork because all the stu all our students are come from a different country and we are speak a different language. So it's really hard to communication with someone that used you speak a different language and have a many hundred thousand idea to put it together and make it work. And I also learned more about the culture and China fact and get a chance to experience experience sell my own design. So far my journey here at Turakit Bandit University it's been so great. Our teacher is a way putting their best effort to teach us and other students and helping finding our best skill. If you join us I can guarantee that you're gonna have like the base talent here that you never have, you will never have from somewhere else, and in the future you will successful. Welcome back to the program. We are still here with our guest, Mrs. Kamonsuri Wongmuk, Associate Dean for Administration, Faculty of Fine and Applied Arts of Turakit Bandit University. So now we entered our last break here. So we already talked about how you try to help your students to become design creators. So what about the, the distinctive points of this faculty? How is it you know, special and unique in its own way? Uh, our faculty uh, in our three programs, we, we, we don't teach the student to be just only the designer, but we prepare them to to be able to create their own business. I see. To, to, um, to have their um, entrepreneurial and creative skill sets. I see. So you prepare them with the business skill sets as well. It's not yes. only about designing, sketching, and creative ideas, but also, you know, management yes. and maybe like things that. like that business needs to be used as. Yeah. I see. Because we have, we, we try to have the, uh, we create a, Extra curricular activities to for them to 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 ex, uh, to show their products after mm. they sketch and make prototype and uh, design uh, after their design concept and mm. after that they 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 need to have the activities some kind like pop up shop mm. to show their concept brand and they need to create their own shop. Uh, the retail management, uh, the mood and tone, think about costing pricing and mm. promotion and campaign and everything to to launch their, uh, their, their first their first brand. And I some see. of them can uh, continue running their business from from this senior project. I see. So when you mentioned about pop up shop and you know you know shops that they have to do, do they have their pop up shops in the university or outside the university? Normally we have the pop up shop in the university but mm. this year, I mean this academic year mm. that will be next April, mm. uh, we intend to have this kind of activity in uh, the department store and I right see. now we start talking uh, with the department store and some of the sponsors mm. uh, some of other partners to, to help each other to to make it uh, a big event. I see. It sounds very interesting, and I think the students are excited when they get to you know do something like this. It's much more than just creating and just yeah. send it to the teacher and just get getting a grade. Yes. 
it gives them that you know excitement yeah. so when you talked about earlier you mentioned that some students can start their business from this this point is there any successful stories that has happened already with maybe your students that have graduated already yeah uh, for example uh, fashion design fashion business there are some alumni who has created their own brand for example Tapakon he he started his own brand since uh, uh, when he work when he do the senior project and after that he continues uh, running his business as a boutique brand name selling in Sunhan World, Siam Center and mm. Siam Discovery and Tabakon also got the reward ten in ten finalists for Thailand in mm. 2014. Mm. Yeah. I see. And this and is fashion? Yes, fashion I brand. See. Mm -hmm. And graphic design students, they had won the first prize in World Star Packaging Design Award. Mm. Uh, and mm. in 2013, I think. Yeah. I see. And some of them had won the first prize in Asian Star and Thai Star Award uh, in order. Mm. And uh, other alumni in graphic design department, they worked in uh, uh, this graphic design company and agency and mm. uh, multimedia mm. and TV channel and also as a photographer. I see. Uh, and I interior see. design, uh, some of them uh, work in the major companies such as uh, major company in furniture design. I see. And some of them, uh, they can be work at, uh, they have their own business as a mm. turnkey interior mm. designer. I see, I see. So there's many successful stories actually from, from your students here. Some of them became their own, you know, entrepreneur and some of them work with big companies in the industry. Sounds very great indeed. So, is there any future plans for the faculty that you plan to maybe you know implement or improve the faculty in any way in the future? Uh, right now, we are working on the, the interdisciplinary study. Mm. Uh, not only the collaboration between university and the industry, mm. but uh, also the combining two academic I see. disciplines uh, to, to, to draw knowledge mm. uh, and create something new in one project. You know? I see. Uh, faculty of Fire and Applied Art, I think we, we can help many in many fields, many, mm. many faculties because we can create some, some uh, uh, value-added products. Mm. Uh, but we need something uh, from other faculty too, of for course. example, in the field of marketing campaign and uh, accountancy or uh, faculty of law that we, we need uh, the, the contract maybe review yeah, the contract intellectual property of or something course. like that so I think interdisciplinary is very important now for the, I for the students I see and as today we're here right now I've heard that there's an open house and your faculty is also you know part of it as well so how is it that you're showcasing your faculty in this open house there will be uh, a fashion show from mm. our student, okay. uh, which is the project of the student in uh, the second year. Okay. And uh, they they went to the uh, north of Thailand, mm. and they uh, bring the inspiration mm. uh, from the the aesthetic of architecture in the north north northern part of Thailand, and then after that. Uh, through the design process mm. and they made the clothes by themselves and they create the show by themselves they uh, styling casting mm. and, uh, from and everything that. basically yeah. their own idea and this yes. will happen today yes I see mm. sounds very exciting indeed. and there are very interesting workshop many interesting workshop I see. from other uh, other, uh, other Faculty, uh, curriculums, oh, uh, the departments, uh, and we still have, we also have the exhibition mm. from the works of the students that show uh, the the 
high school student to 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 know that if they like this, uh, if uh, some some student they maybe they are interested in this kind of faculty and they want not to sure yeah. what to do. Today will be the day that yes. they will find out. Mm -hmm. I see. Sounds very interesting indeed, and I'm sure the students must be very excited. Well, unfortunately, that's all the time we have. Thank you so much for joining us today. With the support and the opportunity the faculty gives its students, it helps to prepare the students before entering the real world, wherever changing challenges are always there. Turakit Bandit University Faculty of Fine Arts and Applied Arts definitely succeeded in doing so, as we have heard of the success stories of its students. And that's all the time we have for this episode. Thank you for tuning in. See you next time. Sawadee